Fact of the day. Fact of the day. Hello, hi, and welcome to Fact of the Day with me, Mark Lotsu. Farmyards and fish may protect your child from hay fever. So this is based on a longitudinal study of children born in Western Sweden in 2003. And this is done by Emma Goxor and her team. 4,000 parents took part and this included answering questions when the child was six months old through to when they were 12 years old. Over 20% of them had hay fever when they're 12 years old and 57% of these were boys. Over half of the children saw their first symptoms at about the age of eight years old. Trigger factors included the regular things, things like pollen, furry animals and mites. There is a view that being exposed to fewer microbes and or your diet is causing an increase in the instances of allergic reactions in the population. The interesting point is that two things indicated a reduction in the amount of hay fever within the population. One, toddlers who ate fish at least once a month are less likely to develop hay fever as an older child. So it's been found that in communities that eat a lot of fish there are lower instances of allergic diseases and also inflammatory conditions. Also it's been found that children whose mothers have taken fish oil during pregnancy have lower instances of eczema, asthma and food allergies. Mimi Tang at the Murdoch Children's Research Institute in Melbourne, Australia has said it could be due to a higher intake of omega-3 fatty acids which has anti-inflammatory properties. But today's diet contains more omega-6 fatty acids which form vegetable oils and these can provoke an inflammatory response. So this change in the fatty acids that we eat could explain the rise in the allergic response. Initial thoughts were that things like margarine are really good for you because there's no animal fat but it's very high in omega-6 fatty acids. Fish also has vitamin D and other proteins which could have a protective effect against things like hay fever. The second item which is thought to brought down instances or likelihood of developing things like hay fever is exposure to farm animals. Particularly living on the farm between the ages 4 and 12 caused a massive reduction in an allergic response by as much as half. Why is that? It could be that an exposure to a greater variety of microbes at a younger age means you're less likely to develop an allergic response later in life. So, two things you can do with your young'uns if you want. One, feed them fish once a month, and two, take them on regular jaunts to the farm. It might just prevent the development of hay fever. That is, farmyards and fish may protect your child from hay fever. Thanks for tuning in. Love you, bye, love you, bye, love you, bye.